It's me, Nikki. I'm back again. I'm on a roll. Y'all know I come, like, I'll be gone for, like, a couple of weeks and then come back and do, like, 15 videos and post them all at one time. I guess I should just tape them and then save them and then post one, you know, when I haven't made one. But this one, I'm going to just um, show you guys how I do a quick curl to, um, when I don't want to sleep in the fussy rise, I do just, like, a really quick curl to give myself more of a body wave down at the bottom. Of course, this... I told you guys, this has been two days. Those are curls that's left. So I'll just do like a quick. I'm trying to do this quick, guys. So I don't want to be 20 minutes standing here. And y'all looking like really, she's still doing this video. Um, So this is just what I do when I want just like a really quick. I really hate. It's so funny because. This is my first time doing 18 inches with hair. So, when I be wrapping it, it, like, feels like forever because I'm typically, like, 14, 16. And, um, so I feel like I'll be wrapping this hair forever. But, this is what I do when I just want quick curls. And, basically, I'm doing this right now. And I probably won't finger comb them. I'll just leave them out. Just leave it the way that it is. See, I'm it's probably too much hair, but typically works for what I be trying to do. I hate when that does that. Don't get on my tip. Just click. And then when I, um, normally I'll do it and then I'll finger comb it out. I'm losing my train of thought, guys. I'm sorry. Um, normally when I do it, I'll just um, finger comb it out. I just wear it that day. But since I really want these curls for tomorrow, just to have more of a curl, I think I'm going to just leave them the way that they are with the spiral and just wrap my hair up and then finger comb them out again in the morning. I think that sounds like a plan if it works. Sorry. Yeah, don't laugh at my homemade makeshift um, <laughs> curling wand. Don't laugh at it. Don't talk about it. I was being creative. I bought these curlers and never used them because every time I went to try to do a curl or a spiral curl or anything like that, I would um I would try to spiral curl it. It would leave that indent from the curlers, you know, the clamp, and so I just stopped using them. And I used my um my flat irons to do my fire curls. When I wanted these curls, I was just using my flat irons. And then when I saw they had that curling line, at first when I saw it, I was like, what the hell? What do you do? Because I'm not, I'm not, honestly, guys, I'm not really a hair person. Like, I just, me and hair just don't get along. I mean, I can do the basics, flat iron and blow dry my hair and stuff, but I'm really, that's why I always have to go in because it makes life easier for me. I can curl it and all that stuff, but I never really learned how to do all the extra stuff. So, um, when I saw that, I was like, uh, who uses that? What do they do with it? It don't have no clamp. That was the first thing I said. So, when I, um, saw videos, I was like, oh, that looks really interesting. I was like, oh, that's nice. I thought that was cool. So, I was like, you know what? I'm about to break my curlers down and create me a curl line. I'm going to be creative. And that's what it came up. And that's what I came up with. And it, and it works. Like, it works really, really good. I'm still going to give me one because I like the curl line because it goes thinner at the top. It's like really, really thick and then thin. Of course, I know y'all know. But I think I'm, I'm going to still get it because I like the thin curls towards the top. But this is just what I do real quick. And it gives like a nice curl. And when I finger comb it out, it's just going to give me like that beach. I won't say beach. I'll say it gives me like a body wave. And I love the wave. I need to figure out. Oh, let me know guys how I, I be wanting. Uh, I be wanting. Mm -mm -mm. 
I want to get my curls like towards the top. Like at the top. More so like every time when I do my um, flexi rise and when I use the curlers, I curl it. It gives me a curl. And, you know, it gives me a really cute curl. But even with the flexi rise, I never really per se get a curl up here at the top. It's always, they always end up down. Even though, like, the last time I curled my hair with the curlers, I did the crown part, the bottom. I guess I have to do it in three layers, maybe? I don't know. I need help. Let me know. Let me know what you guys think. I don't really like big hair. So when I do do this, like, I don't mind it. It doesn't really bother me, per se. Um, when I do get the curls just at the bottom, that doesn't bother me. But sometimes I do, like, kind of want my curls to be towards the top and then go down. And then, you know, I know I'm babbling, y'all. I'm sorry. I got to concentrate. I don't want to burn my finger. <laughs> um, but, yeah, sometimes, like, I want, like, how the curls, you see how it's, like, right there. It stops, like, right here. I want it to kind of come up and have more curls here. They tend to fall. Even with the flexi rod, I don't know if I should use a smaller flexi rod or what. But, I mean, eventually I'll figure it out. So watch more YouTube videos, I guess. I know. Somebody. I know Kiki did a really, really Miss Diva like. Love her channel. She is just so real. Um, but she did a um, flexi rod set. And she, but you know, she has smaller rods. So that's probably what I need to do. Give me some smaller rods to put towards the top of my head so that my curls will be smaller at the top. And then I'll have more curls. I love the way this curls. Whoever made that magic wand, magic wand. See, look, I'm just making up stuff. Whoever made that curling wand is a genius. I wish I would have came up with that. Because, like, the flat irons, I was doing a really good job with my flat irons. But sometimes it left that indent impression, and I hate, oh, I used to hate that. Then I would have to try to fly iron it out so it wouldn't be a dent. I always be having issues with hair, y'all. That's why I just... This is actually the Virgin Hair Fantasy um, wavy hair. But when I got my second install, my cousin had bomb, bomb flat irons. And she straightened it. So I haven't went back curly yet because I, don't, I, want, I like the curls. Like, I like these loose curls. And I know once I wet it, it's going to go back wavy. And my flat irons is not going to get the hair as straight as I want it to. So... I was like, I'm going to rock it straight for a while until uh, I wash it. So, and I, these waves, these body waves, once these curls fall, so cute. I love that. That was me. I would get my weave. That was me all day. I would get my weave, and my hair would be straight. Like, just this straight. And it would be layered. And it's straight. And then occasionally I'll curl it with my flat iron. And, you know, give it this curl. And actually I would leave it like this. It would just, and just let the curl fall. But with this, I actually finger comb these curls out. So, um, but once I got my first virgin hair, I actually purchased um, virgin Indian hair. And I got curly. Bay, bay. Mm. You talking addicted? I got addicted to curls. I was like, oh, curly? Oh, I need to curl it as long as it goes straight. The only thing with that one, it when I straightened it, it really didn't straighten out the way as straight as I wanted it to. But it was probably my flat irons now that I see. But um, I wanted to get a wavy. So I have my virgin Indian hair curly, and then I have this Brazilian, uh, and it's wavy. Look, man, I was so addicted. You talking about addicted? All I did was wear my hair. Everyone, I got up and wear my hair. I didn't want to go straight. I love the wavy look. It was really, really cute. And it's so funny because um, my friends and my friends be like, you look Dominican when you curl, when your hair is wavy. I was like, oh, look, that's my alter ego then, I guess. That's what we going to call. That's going to be my, um, when I wave my hair up, that will be my Dominican alter ego, I guess. <laughs> Can't y'all tell on that handed? Look how good these curls are on the bus. And then look at the ones on the right. See, I be super tripping. 
but this video I am at 10 minutes right now so it does not take that long but this is just a quick quick way just to um, give yourself some curls real quick without actually separating and laying, you know curling it up like most of the time I'll part it curl it curl it you know and go all the way up to the top but this is just a quick way to do it and like I said this is my um cap It's just a satin cap, and I take my hair. Well, actually, my husband takes my hair. He let me out. And I just put it in like that and wrap it up. And then in the morning when I get up, I let it fall down. And whatever curls I have, I finger comb them and take them out. And typically, like, I'm sorry, I typically finger comb these out. Like, I will finger comb these out right now and then just wrap my hair up. But since um, I want the curls to kind of be there, if I'm going to go out tomorrow, I'm going to breakfast. My mom's coming. So um, I'm actually going to recur this that when I get done with this video, just to bring these curls back a little bit. They fell out a little. And then that's it. So that's just a quick way to give you some curls, give you some body, give you some volume to your hair. And that's just what I do when I don't want to sexy ride it or don't want to actually curl all my hair, like go by layers and curl it all. Uh, just at the bottom so if you guys have any questions let me know and i will talk to you guys later bye